Open the connector view. This window is designed to be your musical desktop. The right part displays the scores contained in the open document. Initially, a document contains one score, that you can see here as an orange colored rectangle. To display its content, click on the first icon of this rectangle. The score is displayed and you can modify it with the Pizzicato tools. You can add a score on the desktop with a right click, alt click on the Macintosh. A new score contains only one measure. The scores contained in your document are also visible as a list. A score may be moved or renamed. The upper left part displays the Pizzicato music libraries, as a tree structure. In these libraries, you can find a set of prepared instruments called basic instruments. To explore a node of that structure, you may click on the plus sign and its content is displayed. You may resize the library view. Instruments are sorted by families and each family has a color. The instrument colors being brighter as their pitch ranges are higher. This instrument's library may be used to create or complete scores. Drag and drop an instrument on the desktop and a score is created, ready to be used. You may drag and drop additional instruments very easily. You may then use the Pizzicato tools and their shortcuts to add nodes. The corresponding rectangle displays the various colors of the instruments. You can add measures to the score with the contextual menu. The selected score is displayed in red. The upper scale displays the measure numbers of the selected score. 
An horizontal zoom may be used to adapt the visible part of the desktop to its content. The selected score may be played with the play button or with its shortcut, the spacebar. The second icon of a score displays the volume and effects sliders. The other views are available through the contextual menu. The various scores help you to organize your musical work. You can drag and drop a musical selection from one score to the other. The last icon of a score is used to delete the score from the document. The instruments library also contains the percussion instruments, so that it is quite easy to add them in the score. You may directly import a MIDI file on the musical desktop, for instance when you want to import a theme written with another music software. You may associate one or more audio wave files to a score. This window is a real musical desktop where you can organize your music composition. You can define it as the default view displayed whenever you open documents. The content of the desktop is saved under the name of your document and is restored when you open it again.